Welcome to the series of video tutorials on getting the most out of MetaTrader 4, also known as MT4, brought to you by IMFX at www.imfx.com. This tutorial will cover the use of the Journal and Experts tabs. The first thing we note is that they are located in the terminal section of our MetaTrader 4 platform. The Journal and Experts tabs are primarily used for troubleshooting purposes when something goes wrong with the MetaTrader 4 platform. The first thing we will note is that the Experts tab does not show here. As its name implies, that tab is only available if we are using Expert Advisors on our MetaTrader 4 platform. For the sake of illustration in this video tutorial, we will only be explaining the Journal tab because the, they function entirely the same way. So now if we click on Journal, as its name implies, it gives us a line-by-line -line journal or summation summary of the trades that have taken place on our account. Now if we click here and make this section larger, we can see that earlier today and please note that the time indicated in the time section in the journal and experts is your local time that is not to be confused with the market watch time which is based on broker server time on GMT this would be your local time with the experts and journal tabs so we can see at 1420 today this is my account number and a sell order was placed on my account the next line shows that the order was accepted by the server the request is now in process and then it shows the order was opened a ticket number assigned to it and it shows the specifications of the order the same ones that I can see in my terminal area and also in account history once the trades closed then notice that I modified this specific order again it shows all my information that was order request was accepted by the server the request was in process and then we see the order was modified and then finally I closed this order that request was accepted by the server the request was in process and the order was closed and as mentioned earlier sometimes this can take it seems to take a great deal of time but we can see that all of that took place within the same second this is hours minutes and seconds sometimes during news times and a of times of low liquidity and volume there can be delays and again it's important to make note of that before contacting the broker because that is completely normal now to access the journal logs I simply right click anywhere in this space and the option that I have is to open copy would be to copy and paste the line into another document so if I click on open now I see the logs that are available please note that logs available in demo accounts tend to be limited to save server space however with a live account you would have access to all every single trading day that's on your live account would be available in these logs notice that they have the dot log extension to open a log I can simply double click it and it opens up inside of Windows automatically in notepad and I will see all the information for that specific day if these logs were requested by the broker for them to evaluate and to see if there are any issues we could simply open the file click on file click on save as and it's very important to note that the log files have the same extension and the same date in both the experts and journal therefore I should want to name this for example put an A after it and the second one I could have put a B I want to distinguish them or I can totally rename them and call them anything that I want but the default is the year then the month and then the date 
so I can put an A or B after that to distinguish them. Once I have chosen where I wish to put the file and I've chosen the name, I simply click save and the file will then be saved for me to be able to email to the broker. So as we can see, the experts and journal tabs are very useful in the day-to-day -day operation of our accounts and especially with a live account. That is it for this video tutorial. Thank you for your time and attention and I look forward to being with you on the next one.